hey, 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 what's up everybody? Good evening, Thirsty Thurston here and today we are going to do some playtesting on uh, the latest features and um, yeah, what you call it. Let me just swap over to the other screen. Um, hold on. Alright, I think that's good, yeah. Hi, what's up? All right, today we're going to be playtesting um, the newest version that I have just been working on. I mean, today is my last day of my vacation. Hold on, let me put on some lights here. Uh, there we go. Beep, beep. Hi, hi. Okay. So today is the last day of my vacation from work. Um, in the past month that I was off, I have been working my ass off to get as far as I could in this update because I knew that I wouldn't have sorry I knew I wouldn't have a lot of time when this was done uh, or when my vacation was over um, so I have been grinding the shit out of this that's why I haven't been streaming a lot of games lately um, every now and then I did it I did some um, I have a, a a built or packaged shipping build that is already ready on my hard drive but I actually want to run this one as well because uh, this dev package uh, allows me to use the um, what you call it the uh, console commands so if I run into any issues or I need to debug something I can use console commands to actually get uh, some visuals or see why certain stuff is, I don't know, loading slowly or whatever. Um, but because it's a packaged build, it does not have the overhead of Unreal Engine or the, the editor running in the background. So I am just going to wait a little bit more until this is done. It should take about, I don't know. The first run took five minutes total or six. The second one took eight minutes total because I was also streaming. So part of my processor processing power was going to OBS. Um, currently it's done three minutes and it should be halfway. So we're going to get there soon. So this is very interesting and very cool. I'm very happy to um, have come this far. Uh, currently the update has a lot of new features and since the last update and um, devlog video that I posted on the um, on the YouTube channel a lot a lot has been added we have a menu now we have saving and loading um, we have a character and a lot a lot more um, the only thing that I've yet to figure out and make working is respawning when you die i think that is and uh some bugs and things that we're gonna run into today are the most are most of the things that actually need to happen before we have an experimental update on the reboot so that's very exciting um while this is running i'm gonna go quickly grab something downstairs and i'll be right back don't go anywhere just sit here and, um, yeah, I don't know. I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. All right, so it is packaging now. So cooking is done. That's the longest part of packaging a project. <laughs> yeah, Moop is downstairs. She's barking every now and then. Ah, there it is. It's done. All right, guys, we can finally start this show. So um, I've been working my buttocks off and this is the map that we have everywhere where you can see trees is basically playable area sort of well i mean this is also playable area but i'm not sure if you can actually reach there easily um and what is wait what's this oh no don't tell me this is motherfucker okay well <laughs> um yeah that's something that i need to fix that's i'm gonna change that right away otherwise all these orange blocks that you might be able to see won't work i don't think you can actually see it that easily on the stream uh wait did i turn off the editing of the navigation real time hold on let me check that real quick otherwise we're gonna be sitting here waiting for hours which we don't have well we have that approximately but we don't want it <laughs> uh yeah i turned it off okay good now i can scale this puppy up need to go a bit further away yeah, we can almost start playing guys we don't have to repackage it for this but it's an important step to fix oh my god that's gonna take ages let me just do it uh wait you know what let me actually grab the pcg volume size here copy nav mesh and then uh paste yeah and then we grab this location copy paste is the rotation the same or is it off no that's already the same good good okay already fixed that nice okay well that's set good good awesome sausage bam, bam, bam. okay yeah so what i just changed for the geeks under us that's probably only me but anyway i changed the nav mesh uh bounce volume if i zoom out again and i press on the p button you will see a green area on the map i think no you will not ah okay well you will not and um, the nav mesh uh volume and nav mesh is important for ai uh to find their way around the map so if the animals that we have need to walk around we need them to have a nav mesh otherwise they are not allowed by the engine to find a certain point on the map so they basically roam around by just picking a random location on the map however that location is inside the nav mesh and if the animals don't have a nav mesh they can't move so we have an orange block over here and right here in the middle and the animals that were spawned in there couldn't walk around because the volume was too small. So in the playtest that we're going to play right now, they will not be walking around if we find them. Because they don't have a nav mesh, which is okay. It's fixed now, so we can make sure that that gets packaged with the next one. I already have a small list here of things that I need to check and make sure that I... Well, I don't really have a checklist so much, but I do have... Um, a list met things that I a sort of to-do list with things that still need fixing um, let's see I want to go to builds dev builds tpog dev play test and then this one all right guys look at this <laughs> maybe Rob maybe We have a main menu now. Yay. We have an options menu with, well, these are not implemented yet. We uh, can set the uh, volumes here. Hear that difference? Oh, yeah. I don't know. It's quite low, I think. Let me put it like here.
Yeah, that's some music that came as a sample with the uh, <laughs> with the uh, with the menu. I have no idea what kind of music that is or where it's from. We have advanced video settings, graphics that we can tune everywhere, all over the place, and we have controls. And most of these I have set up. Not all of them are visible here. Everything works basically. Yeah, this room is very 80s looking, huh? I like that too. That was the goal. Um, the controls in here work. All the controls that you need are working. But not everything is visible here. And not everything I have set to remappable. Um, but we're gonna see that while we play. We can hit the play button. And we have a load and new game button. And I'm gonna click new game. Because I don't think I have any... No, there's no game to load. So we're gonna hit... New game. Actually should maybe see if I can make the uh, load button invisible if there is no save game. Now this needs to be restretched a bit. But that's like tiny detail semantics. This is ugly. I need to see if that's fixable. Uh, loading screen. So I will be writing some stuff down here as well today. Hold on, let me just lower the volume a little bit. Loading menu image. Okay. Whoop. All right, we have our character Theodore back in game. He uh, doesn't really, he currently doesn't really move like an old man, but we'll see how uh, that changes over time. And now we're just gonna play the game like we're new to the game and don't know how this game works oh wow here's a rock let's pick it up now i do feel some stutter and lag here and there so i am actually going to uh can I click this yes options video and then graphics i'm going to quality preset back to high i think uh lens flares i think that those can be off yeah skill quality yeah that's probably fine there is also a benchmark button that i haven't tested yet i'm curious how that will work and if it will work at all oh yeah that's way smoother all right pick up stick i'm just gonna pick up some stuff right now because we need some stuff to test of course we also want to test the building system and everything so hell yeah brother Alright, I fixed the sticks as well. That's nice. Yeah, and keep in mind, optimization is still on the list as well. Everything, most of the items that you see, like this rock and the bigger trees, they all have 8k textures, which is totally overkill. So yeah, those need to be tuned down. I think we need a whole bunch of fiber for crafting. Let's just pick up more fiber. Let me know, by the way, how OBS uh, treats the game. If it looks shit or it doesn't run, let me know if it's uh, laggy as fuck. Because I have turned off my preview, so it performs a bit better. I already noticed that it's not running really smooth. But that's to be expected. Actually do uh, stats a unit graph, right? Yeah, to see what is what, what's going on, what is taking a lot. The game threat is quite low, that's actually really good. That was way higher before. GPU time, the draw calls are still high, okay, yeah. We also have cars, but you have you sh guys should have seen that already in the uh, in the what you call it. Oh wow, the loading is shit here. Do you know what's popping in? Yeah, the draw calls are high. Okay, hold on. Can we see if we can turn down some? more settings for now shadows can be lower view this textures yes in fact i'm gonna keep 
Maybe this can go, this can go a bit lower as well. Shading quality. Higher on increase the quality of shading. Okay, whatever. Yeah, this should already be better. Oh yeah. Yeah, okay. Draw calls are still kind of high, but that's okay. Like I said. Do it, success! Optimization is still on the list. Oh, this is already way better. At least, I feel like. I don't know what my current FPS is, because I'm not showing that. The virtual shadow map page pool overflow. Okay, that's okay. That might be because I changed some settings. I don't know, we'll see. Picking up a lot of stuff right now that I see laying it aimed. Uh, what the hell? Okay. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the shadows are definitely freaking out. <laughs> Oh, well, that's okay. I am today mostly um, focusing on... Uh, how do you say that? On game mechanics. I'm curious if I've set this menu up correctly. If I... I think I forgot something here. If I turn down these... Will the cars go softer? Nope. <laughs> okay. Write it down! <laughs> <laughs> now that's luckily a very very easy and quick fix so I'll just try to keep playing and whenever I find something I'll write it down and once I feel that we have seen enough for now then I will uh, start going back to the engine and start fixing shit. Oh, look at this proprietary toilet swapping system. Oh my god. Oh my god, sir, you're such a, an amazing developer. No, no, no. Oh, also we have a map now. Ah, shit, it still shows the fucking Oikins. Shouldn't have done that in game. But that's okay, I thought I fixed that right before I packaged it, but apparently something slipped through the cracks. Or maybe it's because we we found one. I don't know. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> Where if you remove the fog of war cheat? Um your remove the fog of war cheat is uh in the game all along. It's called Play the game. <laughs> <laughs> ah, just kidding. But um, no, there is no cheats. Because I literally don't know how to implement those. <laughs> now, if I am going hungry or, or we will have problems later on. Right now, I still have a debug item here that will s reset all my stats to 100. So that's nice. And I have a lot of other debug items here. Uh, or testing items, if you will. Uh, to, to test certain things. Um, and yeah, we can basically uh, start with uh, with those. And those, of course, will be removed once the update releases. Because otherwise, why play the game, I guess. As long as it's my game, there's no cheats, I guess. But only for me. Because I'm the deaf. Here, look at these trees. Even when I set the texture qualities to lower, they still look impeccable. Interesting. Wait, how is the draw call when I go up to the tree? It's actually very good. I mean, good, good. It's running around is worse. I'm interesting what's making it so bad or what's causing it. It's probably shadows. It's always shadows in Unreal Engine 5. It's nice that everything looks really good, but shadows are a fucking bitch. Right, how much fiber do I have now? 
24. All right, cool. Let's uh, start chopping some trees. So we're going to need to start crafting soon, guys. Otherwise, what's the use? Get some more mushrooms here. And I'm curious how it is going now with certain recipes. Because last time I was playtesting, I found out that like um, campfires and such already had the recipes for the mushroom skewer thing. The shish kebab with mushrooms, which it was not supposed to have, but I don't know. I also don't know how it got the recipe, so it's interesting to uh, see why that is. Alright, where should we set up camp? Should we uh, just go over there and grab the car and just start driving? Oh no, wait, I'm gonna pick up one more thing. Or maybe a few more, because then we have level 2 and then we get twice as much stuff when we pick it up. Oh my god, come on, give me some good. Oh my god. Oh yeah, these mushrooms are good to pick up for XP. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Now look on the left side of the screen. If I pick this up, I'm getting now two. So that's nice. Still get only XP for one, I think. But I'm getting twice the amount of resources. That was something that was missing in the old version of the game as well. I never really thought about or never really looked into setting it up and making it work. And I was like, yeah, I want to make sure that those things are working. Oh, look at this fog. That's really good. Mm, beautiful. B E A A beautiful. Here, twice the chamomile. It's nice. It's good for healing properties. Okay, let's uh, head back to the Le Station de Gas, aka the gas station. Let's see if. Um, What's his face? Manuel, I think. <laughs> he has some cool stuff to sell us. Look, this is uh, Manuel. Manuel is, uh, is a trader. Trader? No, trader. Um, and we can buy food and shit from him. Let's buy this. Get maybe... Mm, nah, let's get this one too. How much money do I have? 208. Now we can also sell him stuff, I think. Is he interested in these? No, he's not, I think. No, that's too bad. Um, how about anything else? Victor? No. Mushrooms? No. Maybe I can't sell it to him, I don't know. Seems like he's not interested to buy anything. Oh, fuck you too, Manuel. Manuel. Let's... Um, Let's get some gasoline though, because we're gonna need that probably. Trade one, trade, trade one. Alright, maybe three, just in case. And then if we walk up to the car, we can drive it. Then the controls will show up on the top left. Turn on the engine and drive. Turn it on and drive, drive. Scroll out a bit. You can see how fast we're driving and the amount of gasoline we still have in the tank. Yeah, exactly. Click, link. Well, there's actually a funny thing now. Oh, that's... Wait, that is something we need to test out later too. I found out that you can actually kill the vendors. <laughs> <laughs> and they will not respawn. So once you kill... Oh, mushrooms. Ah. Uh, they will not respawn if you kill them. So if they die, then um, they're gone. So that's something I need to fix. <laughs> nope, but we're getting close to uh, an actual update, Sebastian. Getting close. Hell yeah. I know I saw more of them, right? But now all the foliage spawned in, so now I can't fucking see them anymore. Hmm. Well, I'll just pick up another rock then. Oh, here. Mushroom. Dandelion. Mushroom. Pew. Mushroom. Mushroom. Okay. Here we go. Okay. 
Oh, the sun is coming through. That's nice. Go away, fog. Go away. Go away, you. Go away. All right. Right, all right. We also have storage in the trunk where we can put stuff in. Um, let's uh, put this in there. And I don't know. These and these, these, these. We don't really need those right now. I'll put the planks in there as well, but we're going to need those in a second. Oh, the meat is uh, going down. That's okay. Luckily, it's going slow still. Pick up some more sticks and then we're going to drive to a place where we want to build. I have no idea where we're going to build though. Let's see the map. Do we have anywhere? Could have built over here maybe. Here, Oh, we drove past the campsite. And there's a cabin off in the woods here. Now those icons should of course be a question mark. Until you actually uh, get close. Why am I not in voice chat? I don't know. Let me uh, get in voice chat. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't really think about it. Okay. Let's, uh, I'll be in the stream hawk uh, beaches. I'll be in stream hawk. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, bam, bam. What was that sound? Hmm. Double pickup sound, I guess. I don't know. Let's get back to the... I know that there is like an opener area somewhere close, but where is it? I think it's somewhere over here, maybe. There's also here, but is it? no, it's, it should be over here somewhere. And otherwise we can build below El Capitan. Actually, let's uh Hello? Oh there we go. Let's get over here and go to this cabin over here, because this is a road, as you can see sort of. Doesn't really stand out, but that's of course the purpose. Because it's a dirt road. Alright. Bam 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 bam. Here, now I am in voice chat, and where are they, huh? Complaining. Get that. Now there should be some good stuff over here that we want. We can cook it as something up in here. Yeah, let's cook this meat because, you know. Ah, shit, my sticks are in the car. Oh, no, wait, they're here. Just kidding. Uh, I can only make. No, I can make several. Go. Ah, shit, my other mushrooms are in the car. Let me just uh, look at that. Doesn't that look great? I fucking love how I did that. Okay. Let me quickly go grab the mushrooms from the car so we can cook them something up. I don't like how all the pick up balls are visible. I need to see if I can change their culling distance. Take the planks. I actually can cook chamomile uh, stuff as well. Oh, and soup. Dude, we can make so much shit already. We are really good gamers. Oh my god. Foraging simulator. I hope I can actually get back up here. Look at the smoke from the barbecue. Mm -mm -mm. Delicious. I can craft two. Seriously, how much does that take? Eight? Wow. 
Very unforgiving gamers. My lord. Uh, the water is in there. I'll take this. I'll put these in. And then... Oh, I don't have the recipe for mushroom soup yet. Or for the tea. Okay, well, then... Ha! I guess we kind of have to go figure that out, huh? Alright, I am actually kind of hungry and thirsty. So let's eat something. Consume. How does that... Food full. Still thirsty. Let's grab a drink inside, though. There is a little book over here that I would like to have. Please. And this is another part of the play test here. I need to see. Okay, it is pick upable, but it's not easy. And it's at zero. Oh no. Okay, that's interesting. That's broken. Why are. The fuck? Huh. What the hell? What was that? Okay, something weird happened, I guess. Book. Not. Pick up a bull? Question mark? It's a recipe book, but we should be able to pick them up. Why are these suddenly... Starting to degenerate. Let's eat a few of these then. Alright, there we go. Bam. Hello? Hello, Simon? Nope, he's gone. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we have in here. We can take a nap on the couch. Can drink from the sink. Hello. Hello. I was on my phone, but I moved on my computer. Ah. Which was stupid. Right, we learned the recipe. Oh, it's getting yeah. dark. Yeah, it's 8 p.m. already. Old man, sleepy time. It is. I, uh, I did something today. What did you do? I, I bought something new. Oh, no. What did you get? A few things. I got uh, an SSD for my uh, motherboard, and I got a new normal HDD for storage of crap that I have had on before that I wanted to have down on my computer as well. Nice. And and then I got a PCI card with the. Uh, I'm still trying to get that to work, but apparently I can't figure it out right now. And then I bought um, the yeah, the nose pills. It is the barely legal uh, stick. Okay. Um, the Sixteen thousand. <laughs> the what? Sixteen thousand? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Thrust master. Oh, it's thrusting. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So this. Oh, there it is. A little bit. Okay. We can store stuff in oh, here. Honestly. Just. Uh... Another kitchen cabinet. Okay, interesting. I forgot about that one. Okay. They are interactable, but they are harder to interact with because they're higher, I guess. Yeah. Maybe if I pick up the mug, then no. Okay, that's... Yeah, they're tricky. Okay. Yeah. Pacifist, I just left. Sorry, I did something wrong. It was suddenly in here, and then I, yeah. Uh, so I pulled you in here. Oh. Uh, some. But yeah, it's good. What is this First. cabin called again? Ah, oh, it also. Am I, in oh the... Am I in the stream or not? Yes. Okay. You're in the stream. Yes. Okay. <laughs> um. Shut up. 
speaking garbage. You can leave if you want to. I just didn't know if you realized that he was he began. I can listen. I can listen. Yeah, that's cool. Um, cabin. I'm gonna call it. Uh, I think this is cabin one or two. I don't even remember. I'm just gonna say cabin. Cabin hill. Then I know what I mean. <laughs> I have given them a name, but I forgot, I guess. Oh, it's snowing. Fuck. Whoa, look. Oh my god, this is so cool. This game has a snow trail when you walk, and it's immediate. Wow. Wow. I have not seen that in any game ever. Before. Huh? It actually looks good. Yeah, it does. Everything looks great, and... I mean, I tuned the settings hella down right now because it was already giving me some trouble because I haven't done any optimization yet. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The sound, dude. I don't know if you guys can hear that. No. Oh, I can't. I'm, uh, yeah, not listening to the other thing. Anybody who is listening, <laughs> do you want to build a snowman? Uh. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, you can actually hear the snow crunching underneath his feet. That's the only footstep sound that is in the game. Oh, and I think puddles as well. All right, let's uh, drive to a more open area. I think we got everything from that house that I wanted. I just forgot to make the chamomile tea, but we'll do that on a campfire, I guess. Oh my god. Ugh. Scrunch, crunch. Yeah, bro. I believe the car should also make snow trails, but I'm... Right? Yeah, it does. Nice. I fixed that. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, that's you said cool. you were driving with... In the video, you were driving with uh, mouse and keyboard, right? I'm... Yeah, I'm dry. I don't have... Uh, the gamepad is not implemented yet, because that's a whole yeah, other exactly. bunch of problems. Yeah. That was also why I was wondering if well, you could, uh, in the video, you're driving so neat. So because neat? Every, I try to... Yeah, every, yeah it's shitty. Uh, but every time I try to drive, it's, it's as shitty as yours. Uh, in the video you made, it's actually called this. Oh, yeah. Or is that just because you cut all the bad stuff out? No, I did not, no. <laughs> I do not cut in my videos. Everything is 100% written. No, just kidding. <laughs> oh, the snow crunches are so good. Okay, actually, this is not a great place to start building. Oh, there's another cabin up there. Huh. Let's, uh, we need to first get some more logs, actually, before, or any logs, for that matter, before we start to uh, lay down a house. Oh shit, I don't even know if I can build anything yet. Oh boy, oh boy. Now nah, we're good. Hold on, let me actually see what recipes I have right now. Because I think we cannot build a lot. I think I have fixed that. Oh no, we... Oh, okay. I still have this turned on. Okay. Okay, okay. Need to turn that off. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, okay. Good, good, good. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Hey, look, what's this? Oh, blueberry jam. Yeah, please. Give me. Bloop. Do, 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 do. Here, guys, little uh, spoiler fun. All right, cool. Why did you spoil that? Because. I know that. Rob C actually already knew it was in there, but still. I think a lot of people already knew. Oh, this one is not choppable. Okay. Boring. This one is though. No. Oh, uh, what? He is not actually. Oh no, did I break it? Shit balls. Hold on. 
Oh no, in the process of making the keybinds, I might have fucked up something. What if? Oh, it's probably, oh no, it's because the building shit is also loaded in already, I think. Yeah. Okay, well, that's that's actually a problem because we're going to need that. Um, let me think. How can I fix that? I think it might not actually be that hard. Hold on. Let me just save the game because I should be able to just load it back here. Look, we also get a little thumbnail. Haha, <laughs> yeah, boy! Awesome. And then we quit. We go back to the main menu. There is no quit to desktop. I think I could make that. But the thing is that you also, if you want to load a different game slot, you have to go back to the main menu. Otherwise, everything broke. I've been I've been trying to figure it out all day. And it, keeps, it kept breaking. So I was like, why, why do I even care if you want to load from the, from in-game? Just go back to the main menu if you want to load a different slot. It's the way it is. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Um, still here? No, it is not. Damn it. Um, um. Menu, 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 system pro. Mm. Ah. Think, think, think. Noise. Uh. This one right, and then I can go in. Yeah. Noise is there. Building is zero, movement is one. It's it is movement. No, it's all right. Also one. Why? Now I got all my games moved to the new hard press of call. Nice. Good job. Mm, and then... I'm tired of them. Did you know what happened this opinion. afternoon, Thurston? Feyenoord lost again? No. No. Oh. no I, was, I was playing a game and I was... Uh, Simon wanted to join me and suddenly my screen went black oh. and I was talking to Simon so my computer was running and all that kind of stuff my monitor was uh, fried seriously so, yes wow so yeah. now, now I have a new monitor a monitor and it's, it's bigger it's bigger. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> nice. That's the only reason why he... 27 it, inch. It, it nice. Nice. It, it broke. And I got a good deal, but it was a monitor of 300 euros. Mm -hmm. But it was the last model. So I... Got a demo model. Yeah, it was standing in the, in the shop. Nice. But it... it never uh was on it was a, only a show oh, mode model a... so they oh. did it it wasn't on 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 electric <laughs> so it was only for show <laughs> and i got you buy i got 50 euros off and i got a oh. a, a free hdme cable nice so that's also something nice. about 20 euros so yeah. I, 70 yeah. euros off. Nice. Yes. Good well, deal. Nice. 
yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you would say almost for nothing, but that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's better than full price always, especially for us Dutchies. <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice, dude. Yes. So and it's I'm bigger, glad. so... It's bigger and... Oh, the screen. It's much better. Nice. It's, uh, because it's uh, one, uh, 165 hertz. And my uh, screen here f before this was 100 hertz. It's so sharp. Now this. it just needs a new computer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I already spent so much money <laughs> in the... Last you know, couple of months. When you get when you get home from when you get home from Australia, you still have spent that much money, and yeah. you still don't have a new computer, no. and you're still. So it's not gonna change anything that you're gonna stay down there for six months. No, but so, I'm not. But I'm gonna buy it when wait I'm back. six months. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna wait. Because then you might, then you might save quite a few quid. Yeah, uh, and um, if I buy it now. The gar I don't use it, and the guarantee is uh, maybe uh, two exactly. years, and then I only have one and a half years of uh, insurance on it. <laughs> yeah. So. Well. Oh. Oh boy. The, 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 the business is hearing that we talk about computers. <laughs> Busted. She, she, she says, "What are you going to buy? What are you going to buy?" <laughs> click, click, bats, bats. <laughs> nothing yet, honey. <laughs> no, honey, nothing yet, honey. No, come no. Oh, it's gonna get slapped. <laughs> Als ik terugkom, gaan we de nieuwe deuren kopen. <laughs> just, oh. just say you really need this. That always helps. Yes, but I do that. <laughs> Doesn't help. Okay, now I can finally swipe and chop again. Okay, that's good. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So. Oh, now I just don't know if it will actually work inside the menu i think it should though but i'm not sure because the menu is not loaded here is it no okay now the sad part is we need to write a new dev law dev build before i actually go and do that i need to um do i no i do not do i yeah yeah, yeah. i do in here okay. my safe game i need to basically control x and just go i don't know somewhere over here again so, yeah let's put it over here that's easy Plop. now i'm gonna click build and we're gonna just sit here and wait i'm gonna take about five minutes approximately maybe seven <sighs> so yeah Oh, another thing that I just realized that I need to write down is saving the weather and time states. I don't think I've done that yet, have I? No. UDS save state. Bean. Oh, red. Oh, red. What else? Okay. Now, I don't know if you guys have noticed it or whomever is watching right now. There are no berry bushes yet in the game. Have you seen that? Oh my God, that's crazy. That was such an important part of the old version of the game. Yes, yes, it was. However, I am working on building a better system. Now, I want the berries to certain berries to only grow in certain seasons and i've basically wrote a system around it or coded a system around it um and this one should transition smooth 
without any hiccups. And it should be better. I want it to be better than those Dynasty games because they basically have three days in the season. Then you need to sleep. The game goes black. And then when you wake up, everything is just changed. So, yeah, that's easy. I love easy, but I don't love cheap. So yeah. you want it gradually. Yeah, well, maybe that would be nice, but I don't really think gradually is really doable in that sense. Um, but I do want it to be um, not that you have to, that you're getting, how do you say that? I don't want people to be forced into a black screen to change stuff around them. Uh huh. Because that's cheap and shit. I mean, I could do it uh, like upon sunset or when when you sleep i can do it but i don't want to force people into a season change basically because the seasons change gradually in yes. in our games yeah maybe i could do the bushes also more gradually i'm not sure yet because i've built a system before but now mm. that i'm thinking about it i feel like the system can be better i can basically make it the same way i did my pickup system and currently, I feel like the the bushes might be a bit more expensive performance wise than they need to be. But back then, I was just trying to figure it out and make it work. And I think I have now more knowledge and experience to make it better. <laughs> Kinda. Uh, it is funny though. There's like three people watching and i think like one of them is rob c and one of them is simon i guess and maybe sebastian is still here i'm not even sure like who, who is watching sure i'm not watching no, i'm not, not watching. watching okay i'm not watching i'm so, not watching because i just rebooted my computer watching. yeah who else who else but quagmire now, who else is watching guys let me know in chat i'm curious to see who is coming to these dev streams I always feel like the dev streams are fun for me to do. Everybody asks if I can show more of what I'm working on. But whenever I do a dev stream, I feel like there are way less people watching than when I play a game, which I can understand because dev streams are nerdier, I guess. But I'm just curious what, what, who or what kind of people would be coming to dev streams and who would come that to gameplay. There might also gameplay. be another problem today person, and that is that 90% of the big streamers streaming feel from three hours ago. Three hours ago? Yeah. Oh, one hour, three hours ago, yeah. And who are the big streamers? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I know mm -hmm. a few. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, not you. Oh, bitch. No. Uh, <laughs> the Raptor guy and also on Twitch I know of. And yeah. Hmm. Is Raptor streaming? Yeah, he was streaming today, right? He was in the, in the what was it called? He did about an hour ago. He was in. Oh, okay. <clears throat> he was in New York. When I got home from the store, he was streaming it. Uh... Yeah, he was. He must have come back. Yeah, he came back. Huh? He he had some kind of apparently he had some kind of payday three uh, promotional gig. Yeah. And um, but at Lumberjack Samurai, that is that a big stream or is that just one of his friends that he plays with sometimes? I actually think that it's kind of both. I think he's not small anymore. Oh. Or I'm I'm actually not sure. Oh, why isn't this? But is that one of the guys that started with Raptor as well as a small streamer guy? Uh, you know Raptor longer than I have. Yeah, but I have never, I've never, when I played with Raptor, uh, Lumberjack guy was not there. I've never, I've never, honestly, I've never really seen any of his, uh, his streams or channel. I don't really know what the guy was does. Before you or after? After, definitely after. He 
is playing Green Hell right now, I guess. Yeah, that has also a major oh. update. Yeah. Why is this not work? Oh, this guy has three and a half K subs as well, so he's not that big. Interesting. Yeah, he plays a lot with Raptor, I guess, so... Yeah. Yeah. And with uh, Red is also on his friends thingy. Interesting. So that might be why... Because I was thinking, like, why... <laughs> If Raptor was invited there and he could bring like two extras or if it was like invitation only because he also been to events where he went uh, there and he um, was just there with other YouTubers that were bigger. But yeah, I was just kind of thinking like uh, what, what kind of setup would this have been? Let's see, dev playtest, Windows, YFR reboot. Oh yeah, shit, I don't have the save folder yet. Oh, saved. Oh no. What is going on? Builds, dev builds, playtests, Windows, YFR reboot, and then, oh, I placed it, Ugh. okay, whatever. New folder, saved. And then, you know what? I'll just run the game and see where it plops the folder. I don't even know. <laughs> hey, Maurice. Starfield never looked better. Holy frickin' Dell. I don't know. Starfield is not something that re that's familiar to me. But how are you doing, Maurice? Welcome to the stream. I hope you're doing good today, mate. Senor El Frikandel. You are comparing Starfield to me? Oh, I am Starfield. I don't know. Let's save it right now in like slot 3 or something. Plop. Look at the little thumbnail. Nice. I'm glad I got that working because that was a... A challenge. Let's just alt F four out of this shit. Then see where it plopped the folder. Save games. There it is. And here I want to control V my save game one. All right. And now I want to restart it. Uh, this one. This one more back. Yeah. And then run the game. You still have a day of work to go, so not doing good. Wait, what? You mean like tomorrow? Yeah, I get ya. But I always make you feel better. Ah, oh, thank you. I'm glad I can help out. And um, yeah, I tomorrow I have my very first official day of work. I went yesterday as well, but that was not really work. That was just talking, listening and hanging around. And um, tomorrow I have my first official day of work on my new job. Which is interesting, I'm looking forward to it. All right, there we go. Options, let's tune down these settings right away. This on, no, not all on medium. This one, shadows on medium. Textures, reflections, foliage on medium. Shading quality on medium. Uh, lens flares off, cause that's awful. Who else, whoever thought of lens flares in, in like, I mean, I like lens flares and the effect of them, but the way they work in with Lumen fucking sucks. Okay, slot one. Here we go. Now keep in mind, it's probably all of a sudden not snowing anymore. Not snowing? <laughs> but I... <laughs> oh, and the orange shirt does magic. Oh, thanks, I guess. I imagine Thurston in his suit and tie, but you cannot discuss your work for MI5. Bond. Thurston Bond. <laughs> Thurston Bond. <laughs> uh, I wish. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. And the car's location is also not saved. Son of a bitch. Okay. Thurston Bond. Double O nothing. Hey. <laughs> Pull me. Ah, shitballs. I have to run back all the I way. Know, it didn't... Buffer. 
<laughs> they yeah. got a double O for Buffalo. Yeah. Jesus. It didn't save the car's location. Okay, write that down while I'm running here. Luckily, uh, let me see. Can I? No, shit. I need something to push on my shift key. Fuck. Ooh. Oh yeah, this might work. Mm, yeah, like this. Haha! -ha! Heck yeah, brother. Okay, let's see. You need to figure out some safe settings, which are. Uh, wait, isn't there supposed to be water in here? What the hell? Well, I guess not. That's the dry part of the river. Okay, it's fine. Um, all right, let's just keep running back there. I'm curious if it did save the uh, the inventory in the car because I think it should have, but or not. Interact location as a child. It sh I think it should have saved, but I'm not sure. Saving. Car locations. Shit, where am I now? I'm lost. Oh, no. Oh, wait, there's the road. That's where I was going. Okay. Pew, 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 pew. Hey, lady, lady Sagittar, what's up? Uh oh, it's the paved road. Heck yeah. Look at these yellow bricks. No, just kidding. Um. I'm uh, doing a playtest right now of my uh, of the current build of my game because I think that I'm getting close to an experimental update that I can push towards Steam finally. So I'm basically doing a playtest right now to um, uh, see where the bugs are and where the trouble is that I need to fix before I can actually push it. Um... It, wait, it did save my inventory, right? <laughs> yeah, okay, thank god. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have gone crying! Okay, um... This and this one. Sprint it. I'm so glad I didn't connect the energy consumption to the sprint function yet. God damn it. Okay, um, car location... Um, is something that I need to check. The UDS safe state, I have written that down. And then I'm curious if my inventory is in the car. Did I give him a smaller butt? No, I didn't change nothing. However, he is uh, dynamically live retargeting his animations to the UE5 skeleton. So it might look a bit weird and his animations are more fluent, but also... Totally not like those of a 60-what-year-old man. Um, Sorry. Best fish, shut up. If you see the stream, you would <laughs> you would agree with me. I, I, I can't imagine seeing you run like this for this long amount of time. <laughs> <laughs> no offense. <laughs> you got a wider neck? Yeah, it's possible. I mean... He is uh, he's a bit more buffed. No, I don't know. It's because his uh, skeleton has to basically um, like be the same as the one from the UE5 mannequin. And that is something that is was a bit hard to accomplish. Oh boy, the car is in the ground. Is that going to be okay? Yeah, it is. Okay, it's saved. It's saved. <laughs> I guess we only left this in there. That might actually be... Po oh, that might actually be the case. Now, I don't know what these are. Why is this here? Unarmed. That's weird. It's not supposed to be there, but I guess. Um, Let's go into our this and then unequip these. Oh, now it goes there. Okay, that's fine. It doesn't end this one. And then it goes here. This one in there. Okay, let's uh, do this again. Grab the car. I hope it doesn't flip out. 
I don't think it should, but mm -hmm, there we go. Brrr. He found the fountain of youth. I gave him steroids? No. The empty inventory slots were from the steroids he took. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> nah, this guy is really herbal. I mean, the worst kind of thing that comes close to steroids that he is going to eat is probably something like uh, chamomile. <laughs> Remind me not to get into a car with Thurston. Bro, in real life, I drive okay. But in this game, yeah, in the, games, the it's... The word there is okay. Hey, it's not fuck good, you! It's okay. I drive fine, especially with my new car, because it's not as fast anymore. <laughs> Some bitch. Alright, um, so the nice thing is here, we can now finally chop trees again. So let's just park this baby over here somewhere and just start slashing some trees down. So we can start building. Uh, oh wait, another thing that I need to write down is... Um, known buildables. Okay, there we go. Kia Senseo? What? No, I got a Volkswagen... Uh, a Volkswagen something something. Uh, Golf Ryant, it's a, uh, what you call it, station wagon. Alright, that's one. Let it drop. Another one. That one is not choppable. No, it's it's literally called a Volkswagen variant, variant, variant. I don't know. It's a station wagon from 2017. It's a nice car, but before I had a uh, Toyota Corolla uh, hatchback GR Sport Plus. It was a 2.0 hybrid that had some power, and this one is and it and that was also uh, an uh, an automatic, or what you call it. And this one is a uh, manual transmission, so yeah. Where's car? <laughs> My five people always drive a Prius, you're lying. <laughs> yeah, but you know I can't say that, uh, Maurice, if that were the case. So I can never admit nor deny that I would drive a Prius. So in that case, I'm just telling you I drive a Golf Ryans and you just have to take my word for it. <laughs> oh. The more butch car. <laughs> Alright, let's pick up the logs now. It's funny that the outliner doesn't work anymore. What's going on? Maybe it's because I set settings lower? I don't know. These logs should glow kind of blue when I want to pick them up. Or when I can pick them up. Just like the plant. Everything should actually. Hmm, interesting. Hoppa! Pew pew! Faster, faster! Alright. And this one. Let's see. Which one next? I need more trees. They're in the trees. He has some shoulder action. Hell yeah, brother. Look at him go. I've also been thinking maybe I want him to have a 
two-handed axe for this shit. Because it's kind of weird that he just uses this rusty hatchet and just chops down these sized trees with like a one-handed axe. I mean, I also have a way cooler animation for a two-handed axe. Hoppa. Next. Take it home. Kill the tree. To build a house. Cause we need to test the building. Motherfucker. Fuck yeah. Hello. Pick up the goddamn lock, dude. Come on. It's not. Oh, it's also. Wait. Where's. Oh. It is colliding. Okay. I thought it wasn't. Now the hard part about the logs is also that if they roll, I can't see where the text is. Uh, eh. Yeah. Break it down. Plop. Yeah, that, that collision also needs some work. All right, picking up some logs. How many do we have now? Seventy-one. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go for a... for what? For a bit. Oh, okay. Do we? Okay. Later, gators. Later, boy. Have I added ducks yet? No, not yet. There is some wildlife. I I had wildlife in the previous version of this game. Um, but I had to restart because of the V2 of Hyper's products and so I basically um, have no... I have brought back two types of animals currently to hopefully see if that will... Uh, yeah, two types of animals to uh, kind of... Uh, just for testing as, at the start and then later we can always expand that. Chop it down. Yeah, these trees really... Ah, I need to fix that. Oh, man. I need to go through all these trees again. Damn it. That sucks. Whoop. The annoying thing is that just a capsule doesn't work. I need... To the outer convex ones and those are annoying maybe i can just destroy the ones at the top or something i don't know ba -ba -ba -ba. oh yeah this is fun Whee! Whee! Cool. Da -da -da -da. Hey, the car is all the way over there. My lord. But no, I do want to add ducks. I just, I don't really know if I have a duck, if I have duck models. And... No, I don't think I have those, and I'm not quite sure what they would cost, because, of course, we need high-quality models. He is the forest ranger of this uh, whole park, so yes, he does. Oh, yes, he does. Alright, let's get back to the car. Let's put the logs in the trunk for now, because we can. 100! I only have 100 logs? What the hell? Now there's more items appearing here. I don't know what's going on here. I feel like... Oh, wait. Maybe that happens when I equip and unequip in the... Oh, maybe that's it. I step in the car. It unequips the hatchet. I get out of the car. And the hatchet still kind of remains here. But also not. Because it's also here. That might be a bug. Ah, oh, damn it. Not good. Nar. 
you better get that fixed. But now I also duped the hatchet. That's interesting. Okay, let's now I have one equipped. This slot is empty, and then the axe is the last in the slot. So okay, let's step back in the car. Unequipped it. Get back out. The hatchet is here. And there's a hatchet there. That's interesting. Now let's see what can i do to test this out i'll unequip this then it just adds another one okay i'll equip it i'll get back in the car it unequips it step out of the car open my inventory and then i'll just try to equip this one and that just works son of a bitch where are these coming from i don't understand unarmed these are the fists, but if I just unequip this, can I equip this? No. Oh, I double clipped, clicked it, and oh no, it just dupes it. Interesting. Okay. Oh. He's supposed to fist attack something right now, and it doesn't work. Okay, that's cool. I can't equip these. Huh, I think I fucked it up. Oh no. Fuck. Re. And my inventory is full. Okay, that's fine. I can put stuff in the car. So can I actually. I can't transfer it. Oh, I can. Huh interesting okay because that was not an option when i right clicked it so that's good to know i can just no i don't think i can build a chest can i no i don't think so uh, okay well that's good at least we have some more space now let's put this in here the locks are already in there yeah all right cool Um, let's see, can we craft this one? No, we need planks, rope, and a short wooden beam. Do I have the recipe for a short wooden beam? Apparently I do not. So we need to find that. Make some rope here. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, I got a... What did I... Tailoring. Okay, cool. Whatever. I That's a lot of XP. Way too much XP. Tailoring? But okay. Yeah, tailoring. Oh, I need a drink and food. Uh, how did I do the fuel for the car? Um, girl, that was... <laughs> that was a challenge, I'm telling you. Um, let's eat some of these berries. Um, so I made a fuel item and then based... Well, it's not that much of a challenge, actually. Um, the fuel basically... Um, if I get in the car, the fuel is just uh, a number that is also not saved yet, I think. Write that down. Um, fuel. Okay, there we go. Um, <coughs> uh, the uh, the um, how do you say that? Um, the uh, oh, I need to start the engine. Sounds are still playing already. Look at that snow tracks. Wow. Oh, they are kind of offset. That's interesting. Oh yeah, they're hella offset. <laughs> um, snow trail. Our snow trail. I basically made it so that um, you have to turn the engine on, and once the engine is on, it um, consumes fuel by a. a preset number i basically kind of calculated the amount of fuel that it could store in the tank uh, i calculated that 
slightly with why is it not reacting wow okay feels a bit off um the uh, fuel is slightly calc it's cal um i looked up i know what kind of car this is supposed to be at least i think i know um and i looked up what kind what amount of fuel this car held back in the day um and um uh, the amount of fuel it held and then it basically consumes fuel with a, a preset amount of fuel consumption and then based on the uh, rotations per minute it consumes more or less um, so hold on there we go um, so it consumes more if I make more um, RPMs so right the 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 gauge the needle on the gauge is for rpm and the kilometers an hour or miles an hour i don't know which one it is is in the digital numbers um hold up yeah fuck i oh, know um There we go. Um, so the RPMs influence uh, work as sort of a multiplier. Because that's how it works in real life as well. If you drive in a lower gear with a higher amount of RPM, you use more fuel. But that's kind of what I tried to um, simulate as well. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. I need to go to the carpenter. And you guys don't know where the carpenter is, but I do. <laughs> yeah, boy. Why do I know that? Because I built it. Uh, your driving belongs in the 18 TV series. Yeah, bro. Speeding costs more fuel. Yes, yes, it does. And that's exactly why we already bought fuel. Because we uh, don't want to get without fuel. Here, look at this. Nice log above the road hanging there. Very dangerous. Awesome. Love it. Uh, we also have first person mode in the car. Alright. Now I think my lantern would work as well. Won't it? Hello. Oh no, I d Oh yeah, I broke the equipment slot. God damn it. Well, then we'll just have to run in the darkness, I guess. Um, so I created it in a way that the car um, basically just has a variable in the blueprint that is the amount of fuel. And um, the fuel is, I think, I don't know what it's set as, but the, the, the gauge that you see on the, the progress bar or whatever you call it for the, the, the uh, fuel is in percentage. So there is some calculation done in the background. I can show it to you in Unreal in a minute um, how it looks. Ah, here it is. Um... Oh, it's so sad that we that it's so dark right now. God damn it. And the car location is not saved, so I don't really want to like drive all the way back. But the carpenter is sitting right here in her rocking chair, but you can't really see her because it's dark AF. But she's sitting here and I'm gonna talk to her. I want to buy Yeah, all the short beams. Uh, I also want to buy this, but we cannot use it yet. And the salt table is a nice thing that I added, which um, basically if you use a salt table, you have the same recipes as you have on, for example, a workbench. But it gives you more bang for your buck. So if you use one log, you get like, I don't know, eight beams instead of four or something. No, it's all fine, uh, lady. I can show you. I like to show things that I made uh, I think I also need these insufficient funds. What? 
Yeah, but that's... I, I want one. Can I buy one? No, they're three ninety a piece. Are you kidding me, woman? Fuck. Do you like planks? Oh, they're nine... Oh, shit. <laughs> do, you, do you want to buy my sleeping bag? Um... Maybe she wants rope. Yeah, she does. Cool. I still don't have enough. For one. God damn it. Um. Stone? She buys stone. Okay, I want a crazy woman. Okay, now I have enough for the saw. Trade a one. Wow, saw is expensive. Jesus. This is 60 coins. I, be I want it back. Damn it. Stupid bitch. I'll give you my stone. Okay. I am uh, kind of out of money. But the nice thing is we can use her stuff. If you have the uh, skills for it. Oh, and the salt table also takes uh, gasoline. Because it has a little generator. Because it's of course electric. Um... Now we can go inside her house, which does have light. I'm going to drink some out, some out of her sink. There is a bed here in which we can sleep. I think we should do that, actually, just to get past the darkness. Wait, what time is it? Uh, that's the wrong button, this one. It is 12 a.m., so if we sleep for eight hours... No, four, actually. I think it gets light at four. Still need to set up a cinematic for this. What time is it now? 3.34.43. Yeah, okay, one more hour. There we go. Now it's morning. Bam! There we go. And we could have also napped inside her in, in her uh, couch thingy. And then here is a little booklet that I cannot touch. Shit. Well, I can, but it's like very tricky to reach it. There it was. Uh, there it is. Beam. Oh no, it doesn't work either. Oh man. What? Son of a bitch. Okay, that's really fucking bugged. Recipes don't work no more. Recipe not added. Why could that be? What if it's because I need to have a certain level? No, that can't be it. What can it be? Okay, well, luckily I didn't set everything up correctly yet. So we can at least use her shit to... Or I mean... Oh yeah, here now we can see her. Look at her sitting there. Cool as woman. Wee. So she has a salt table that we can uh, salt planks on. Apparently we can use this already. There's, I thought there was a, li a limit to the level that we needed to have. And this can also make planks. This will... It doesn't say how many it gives back. Why does it say pick up? Oh my god, I thought I turned that off. I did not. Okay, that's good. That's good. Items in world pick up a ball. Oh yeah, I know why that is. Well, in this case for testing, I'll just yoink that from you. Oh yeah, if there's stuff in the inventory of an item or of, of a crafting bench or whatever and you pick it up, it will drop it on the floor, which is nice. She also has a few boats here, right? Yeah, look at them. Ah, they don't work, but they look funny, I guess. Um, We can also cook it as something up here, maybe. Oh, look. Yes. And this and this. This, this, all of it. Yeah, we 
need more water. Oh, they are not stackable. That's interesting. Okay. Um, it, this also gives heat, of course, which is nice. I am going to fill up my bottles. If I press F, they should have filled. Yes, that works. That's awesome. Now I can stack these again. I don't know why empty bottles aren't stackable. That's kind of weird. That needs to be fixed, bro. That needs to be fixed, bro. And I want to make two more of these. I want to make some chamomile tea. Oh, I haven't set that up correctly. Okay, that's interesting. Item name, zero out of five. Okay, chamomile tea recipe. Okay. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. She needs a kitty cat. Yeah, I was actually thinking about uh, giving her a doggy or something. Yeah, kitty cat could work as well, I guess. Um, let me drink and fill up the bottles again. Does she have anything in here? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Um, let's uh, set this loot lower. <laughs> That's a very well st fucking hell. Uh, car. Sirs. Kitch. Cab. Loot. Wrong. But all I don't think I even set this up yet, cause. This is hella high for everything. What is even the antidote? We don't even use that. Jesus. Bandage and painkillers neither. Um, my inventory is full. Damn it. I do want to take your apples, woman. And the cookie. I actually should take more. Everything I can. Because I can sell that. Ten bread. Holy crap, dude. This is not set up correctly. 7 coins, 17, 6, 4, 11, 17. I know that uh, Carl, now Emmanuel, down at the uh, the gas station will definitely... Wait, he will probably buy this too. <laughs> this. <laughs> Just sell her junk out of her own kitchen cabinet. <laughs> <laughs> That's wait, hold on. Let me check if that works because that would be hilarious. I wonder if people will think about that. She has 500 coins. Okay, here we go. Ah, she doesn't. Okay, she w d won't buy that. Then that neither. Okay. Bread? No. No. Charcoal? Oh, she does buy charcoal. That's nice. What is the selling price? 38 coins? Okay, that needs some balancing. Holy crap. Do you want herbs? No. Ah, she does like other stuff. We don't like that. Do you like cookies? No. Mm. Okay. Well, I do need to eat these berries before they go bad. There we go. Okay. Well, uh, bye. Did I put all my sticks in here? Yes. Oh, shit. There is way more. Oh, fucking hell. Um, shit balls. Well, I mean... Oh, I can actually... <laughs> hold up. Hey. There you go. Thanks for your money, bitch. <laughs> I got some cash in my pocket. Yeah. Wait, where are my other water bottles? I had three of them. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Um. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I'll eat the cookie. Then I can take this with me. Okay. Then I'm going to fill it up. And then it's stackable again. All right. Here we go. We got this. Two bottles. I had three. I don't know where the other one went. But that's okay. Well, it completely cleaned her out. 
Let's go back to the car. Now we can start creating some planks and shit. And we can start building. Squirrels. Squirrels are already in the game. Or they will be. They were in the previous one. In small areas. But they... I want to bring in uh, rabbits and squirrels and other rodent kind of stuff. But the trick again is balancing all of it, you know. Because um, a lot of these AI things, they require a lot of computation. Which is just sad because I don't want them to be expensive. But I also want there to be a lot of them. So I really need to think about how I can fix that. Maybe as Niagara particles or whatever. I don't know. Oh yeah, I need to keep in mind that everything I pick up now is twice the amount. Because my level went up. Which is thrice the amount. I need to nerf this as well because now you can get to level 99 and if you have level 99 in foraging one pickup will get you 99 items which is kind of a lot I think I need to make yeah clamp it down a little bit so that there is only like a certain top amount or something I don't know Let's put this in here put this in here um Yeah, planks maybe, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I guess that's okay. Let's start with this. I'll actually fill up the car as well, just to get rid of the gasoline. I don't know how much fits in there. Okay, they all fit in there. That's nice. Oh, Jesus, that, that's not a lot. Okay. Alright, let's go uh, over uh, over yonder, where we were before chopping trees, and let's start building a cabin. Or something. <laughs> oh no! We just want to go off and on again change what I stream from. Okay. I actually want to check out this cabin as well because I need to see if the recipes that are around all work. Especially because some of them didn't work. I need to be sure that or I need to find a correlation or whatever. Yes, correlation. Okay, that's annoying. Okay, I need to really, you know what? Let's uh, try this in first person mode. There we go. Redberry jam. Okay, jam is useless right now because there is like no. Uh, can we build anything? Oh yeah, we have. Okay. Yeah, the jams are only craftable in the stoves. But there's no berries yet, so yeah, we can't really use that. Raw meat, we don't have raw meat. Can actually make something with the bread as well, maybe, since it's already in here. Oh, purple berry jam. Wait, I already have purple berry, right? Or was it blueberry? Yeah, I already had that. No, there's blueberry. Where's the purple berry then? Huh. It, I learned it and it's not here. Blueberry, yellowberry, redberry. Hmm. I know I turned that on a while ago to test something. Purpleberry. Oh, wait, I think I could craft that on my person and I turned it, I switched it around probably. Nope. Hmm. I don't know. Whatever. Um, let's go back outside. We do not want to nap wait. Let's first check upstairs. I don't know what I put where anymore. Oh my god. I'm sorry guys. This first person mode is kind of shitty right now. Peppermint tea. Oh hell yeah dude. 
Oh, I picked up two of them. Okay, that's not the way it's supposed to be, but that's fine. Okay, now we can actually make peppermint tea. Where do we make that? Can we make that in the stove? I think so. Oh my god. Yeah. Six peppermint, one water. Hell yeah, brother. We can make two. Needs fuel. Where's my sticks? Oh no, I did. Oh yeah. The couch? What's with the couch? Nice. Opa. And then fill the bottles again. Yeah. Stack them. Alright, there we go. Can actually make another soup. Right? And then sticks. And water. Yeah. Oh, I can actually make more. Nice. Okay, there we go. Put the water back in and make one more. There we go. Pop. Oh, they only stack with 10? That's stupid. Whose idea was that? Soup stack. Maybe, what do you guys think? Should we work with inventory slots or with weight? Because I can do both. But I'm curious what you guys as players or viewers think. Someone should make a horror game starring the couch. <laughs> Almost every <laughs> U UE game that has a couch like that. In oh, you mean this one? This one is not from the free furniture pack, I think, because I have never downloaded that. Um, what is this scene here? Hmm. Um, but yeah, let me let me know what you guys think. Should we work with slots and find and should there be a way to increase it, or should we work with weight and then find a way to increase it, like? have a strength skill or whatever dude where did i park my car oh over there oh boy oh boy Oh boy. Yeet! Hoppa! Yeah. All right, um, let's see. We have our saw table, our thingy table, planks. Can I hold those? I can, but I'll keep them in here for now. And then I'll, I'm gonna uh, place down the saw table. Um, where am I gonna put it? For now, I'll just put it somewhere over. Oh, I can put it here. Okay, that's probably because that's where the animal spawner is. Put it over here. All right, um, Q to get out of building mode. I to place this one. And we, I don't think we can use this anyway because we don't have the, uh, and then Q. Um, this one has the fuel in it already. That's because I set it as starter item. Oh shit, I forgot to fill my bottles. Oh well, that's fine. Um, planks, logs. Okay. Let's see if I put the logs in here now. Oh, hell yeah. 
Craft 10. It puts out a table, a saw. Oh, that's... Eh. <coughs> okay. Plank. Recipe. Saw output. I made it first so that it requires a saw as an input. The thing is you could only craft one at a time because it would eat the saw up and then spit it back out. That's not very efficient and we don't like that. Oh my god, that's so many fucking saws. God damn it. How much weight can he hold before his hip shatters? <laughs> yeah, that's a good question, Rob. I don't know. What would you think? Why is this only putting out one plank though? That's not the way it's supposed to go, I think. Um, um, I'll craft one. That took one log and it took, and it gives one plank. Fuck. That's not the way it's supposed to be. I guess. Um, let's see. Can I use this one? Apparently I can. Put a log in here. I think something is broken here. Yeah, that's broken. Because you're not supposed to be able to do this. And this gives six planks. Okay, that's that's better. Um, so if I craft... The workbench. What do I need for that? I have everything to craft this. Yes, gimme. It also crafts only for what? Five seconds? It's supposed to be longer. But whatever. Um, I, and then place. Put it in the middle here. Whoop. Q to exit. Interact. There we go. We can craft shit. Yeah, here's the purple gem. Okay. I changed that. Uh. Transfer one, create a plank. How many planks is that gonna give me? Three. Ah, okay, I think I have swapped them around then because the workbench is supposed to give you one, I think, one for one. And even that is not correct. That's like, seriously. Uh, plank, output, check. I think I have set the beams up differently. They are, should be better, but you also cannot craft beams in here and we cannot craft beams at all now because I don't, the recipe book didn't work. So that's kind of sad, but okay. However, we have a lot of planks now. We can stack these up to 50, I think. Oh, we don't have a lot of planks. Which one gave me the most? I think this one, right? Check it one more time. I think it gave six, right? Yeah, so, opa. Pump it. Okay. Yeah, this is just gonna run. Oh, we're gonna get so many souls. That's really <laughs> not uh, supposed to happen, but okay. Ah, oh, shit, and now I can't equip this thing right now. Somehow my equipment slot is broken. Damn. Um, I'm gonna take this out and take these. Oh my god, are they stackable to fit? No, they're stackable to a hundred. Or more. A hundred. Okay, that's good. Put these back. I'm gonna reload the game real quick. Because something is not right. And I hope that reloading fixes it. And then we can finally start building something. I'm just gonna leave these saws in here. I think are these stackable? 
No, they're not. Oh, man. Um... Oh yeah, that's possible. You prefer slots over weight, but you're an, a hoarder in games. Yeah, so you can see that that's the same thing I am currently coping with. And also my stacks. I thought they were kind of balanced, but apparently with only 36 slots is not a lot. But what we can do is... Um, because I should have a health point or a level point. How can I should be able to add level points at some point, but I don't know if that's implemented. Hmm, interesting. Huh. Interesting, I don't know how Hyper did that, because previously you could click a plus sign if you had a level point. Oh, but I only get a level point at a character level. Okay, never mind. Wait, do I? I wasn't supposed to. I'm supposed to get them all at with each level up and it also says it on the bottom left you can see above my health bar it says level up I just don't know where those points go because cooking is level 2 tailoring is and foraging is even level 3 so somewhere I should be able to set those levels but I'm not sure where I don't also don't know if I think there should be maybe an extra UI panel that I have not implemented in this UI yet. Um, escape, save, and then take slot two, I guess. Game has been saved. A nice little thumbnail. And then quit, yes. Oh my God. <sighs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yep. uh. I, get this. I can't get my PCI card to work. PCI card? Yeah, I brought a PCI Express uh, with USB, extra USB slots. Hmm. I cannot get it to work. You probably have to set something in your, um, what's it called? In your BIOS then. Maybe. It just says it should be plug and play and then the driver should also be installed. I don't have a CD uh, player anymore. Who has that now? Yeah, I was just about to say, I have uh, a USB one for those edge cases indeed. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I've been thinking about getting one, but I had one a long time ago, but I used that because there was also uh, different card readers in it, and it was also a burner and both CD and DVD burner. Uh, so it's, it was like an external one, but it was like bulgy and yeah, whatever. It died some years back. So uh -huh. yeah. I'll find my old laptop, but oh, yeah. I'm not even sure. I actually took the hard drive out of it earlier today because I thought about just putting that in. But I had to go get certain uh, cables anyway, so... Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, something is so fucked up right now. He equipped it in his head slot. Yeah, okay. The, okay. It's fine, it's fine. Um, let's also make a campfire. <laughs> there we go. And then let's start building foundations and shit. Let's see, how far can we go? Let's go like this. I also don't think I can craft oh. a hammer, can I? Carpenter didn't sell it either. Damn. Okay. Can I actually make uh, one of those? No, I can't. Is that only you that can do that? What? Uh, yeah, it's a 
going to make one of those what's it called loads loadings get people in here oh uh, you mean a pole yeah a pole oh i actually don't know yeah that's a thing now huh let yeah, me actually a thing. yeah let me check that real quick because that's a good idea thank you yeah start a poll where is it um it's it was uh i think it's only for the streamer i can give you Probably, some sort yeah. of uh power so you can do that stuff too i don't i don't know if moderators can it but in the chat there was a plus sign at the bottom where i could do it oh okay then I can't do it. I thought I could because I was a moderator, but I might have some, need some other things to do it. Yeah, I was just about to ask uh, Ladder of C and, and Maurice if you guys still are here. And if you are, how you find this new things. Is there things now that you are looking forward to? Uh, I can't even remember if all of you actually had it beforehand and have played it or if you're just here for the dev stream well Rob see you always here but <laughs> <laughs> okay there should be a poll now I don't know how it works oh it's at the top of the oh, yeah. chat yeah uh and lady sagittar asks how difficult is it adding different building structures i haven't played with it yet waiting on hyper's updates um yeah definitely wait for his updates because he's gonna fuck up everything again um i have no idea i think it's quite hard i haven't really fiddled with it myself um and i'm not really i wasn't really planning on it at least not for now. I have added like placeables because they those are easy, like furniture and shit. But actually adding structures like walls and everything, if you have the right amount of meshes, it's doable. But otherwise it's gonna be a bit hard, I think. Now I need more planks. Wait, I already wow, I went through all my planks already. That's fast. Okay, craft all of them. These salts need to go, dude. All right, just drop them here on the floor. Not too bad, thing. Rob C. But the custom stalls or barns are quite a nice, nice thing. The what? Lady. Oh yeah, that's that's nice. It, I mean, it's doable and. I think Hyper actually has a tutorial on it, but I'm just saying if you don't have the correct sizes, it's gonna be a little bit of a pain in the neck. Dude, there's so many souls that's annoying as fuck. I'm actually curious what pacifist would think of the um oh the weight or the inventory yeah or the slots he yeah. has played a lot of games i would it depends on how things stack that is actually the big thing how stackable things are It's not a lot of the weight, the slots. It's how if you have few slots, then you should be able to stack all of the same. Maybe then 
weight is a thing, but there shouldn't be a cap on, let's say you're walking around with, uh, just for example, wood. Mm -hmm. uh, then all wood should only take up one, like logs one, planks one, and then they should all stack uh, in one. And then it should be by weight. But if it's by slots, then you need to think about how many. But my problem is that a lot of them actually have, in my opinion, too small amount of stackables. I mean, some of them are like, yeah, you can stack, let's say, 20, 20 planks. And you can stack five logs, in theory, when you think about it. That's maybe approximately same amount of of wood you're walking around with but then you have things like stones uh, other things like that and and that might be uh, 20 uh, stone you can you can stack in one and then iron ore which has the same size the same weight that you can only stack 15 or something Hmm. When it becomes uneven like that, that is when I hate it personally. Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. I don't mind either or. I I tend to have more against. If I have slots, then I need to be able to use them. Yeah, definitely. Okay. So the weight should not be a hindrance. Then you could say you have... That's the thing. The weight is the thing, so that you don't only have few slots. So the cap of how things stack depends on the weight. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying, right? It's if you... If I were to go with the... Um... Oh, nice. If I were to go with the um, with the, the weight thing, then your slots will be dynamically added. And yeah. if you carry, then you can like, if you look at the, uh, for example, this is only 0 0.1. And right now yeah. our weight is at 191, but I have turned it off so we don't really use it. Yeah. But um, well, that's also the thing that if, if that's, how it is that you just get more slots how as you use them uh, then you should only it don't make sense to have like that you're having five stacks of onion soup with ten in each or whatever five in each then you should just have 25 in one stack because it's weight anyway does that make sense yeah I think so because then your inventory menu isn't that big. It's as small as possible. When it's weight, it it stems up. It comes out of. Yeah. Lady Rob and Maurice, does not that make sense to you guys? You could do that, actually. That could also be in one of the uh, difficulty levels that hmm. at a certain difficulty you could say it would be weight instead of slots yeah or or the opposite because i would say having a certain amount of slots and weight at the same time is harder than either or yeah, that's true, I guess. It also depends on how things are stacking. Yeah, exactly. I was I was thinking like if you do weight and you get skill points, you can basically upgrade your weight hold capacity thing to be able to yeah. hold more, I guess. Yeah. But it's also about if you think about it, if you have, to, if you want to make it realistic, then you also should do slots. 
because you can only carry that much on you. Not only weight, but also amount. Yeah. Of different things. Oh, they only half ass. They're not. It's not a uh, peak. Yeah. Shit, I'm out of place. I mean, it really depends because if you take a game like Icarus, you have weight and slots. And they stack, the items stack. But if you take an item like, I think it's stone and ore, they go to, is it a 50 and a 100 or something like that? In one stack. Yeah, it also depends on... Um, for me, it's also like how realistic is an item how realistic is it that the item would stack like soup balls yeah. don't stack but if i give you one that if you good. give two if you get two soup soups from cooking them then not making yeah. them stackable is like gonna ruin player experience yeah but you can also say if if your inventory just is expanding as whatever then it doesn't make sense that it don't stack anyway. Then it should be stacked by durability or show the lowest durability uh, at the top. Uh, anyway, because it the overview of, uh, of your inventory gets better, so that's better for the player experience, if that's how you see it. Uh, I don't think I understand. Okay. Um, if you have that expanding storage where no matter how much you put in, you just get a new storage slot. Yeah. And you say in, in real life, soup bowls don't stack. So they get each their slot. Then you make, let's say 20 soup bowls. They have each their slot. So that means that to get to the next thing after soup bowls, you have to scroll down in your inventory. Yeah, that's going to get garbage. It is. And that's the thing. If you're going by weight uh, and have unlimited slots, then everything might as well stack into one. Or infinity. I mean, yeah. But if you're going for... A natural thing like it don't make sense that you can stack more than let's say it's two soup bowls because you could basically basically say they were standing next to each other or something because they're not that big then you can have two in each that's fine but yeah. then you should go by slots because if that's a thing you're you you want to promote <laughs> then you should have a certain amount of slots yeah, I guess. Everybody says slots, though, at least two out of three. Yeah. Yeah, Yeah. I said wait because I just clicked it. I didn't re read what it was. Ah, okay. And I'm st I'm honestly, I'm a bit conflicted, but I think slots as well. Okay. And slots are also expandable by weight or by finding backpacks. I mean, we could add an item just basically like Mist Survival. They have it where you find backpacks and you can just basically consume the backpack and then it adds slots to your inventory. Oh, okay. Instead of yeah. carrying bags. I mean, it could also yeah. make bags that would be bigger, but then you're, yeah, you're, you're going to get limited quicker or something. I don't know. Look, yeah. it snows outside, and it doesn't snow inside anymore. I like that. Oh, you fixed it. Yeah, dude. And we have nice. a bed here, or a sleeping bag, and nice. the house is now like this. There, we, if we, if we were able to pick up the um, what you call it, the books that have the recipes in them, we could also craft eventually the windows and the door. But apparently oh, okay. something is fucked and they are not pick upable. Now there is also some deer out here that don't have a nav mesh, so they cannot walk around. 
So that's kind of sad. Um, I, I didn't see if you showed the others the deer. Have they seen the deer yet? They are seeing them now. Just go close and stab it here to access. Yeah, I could do that. I just shot him three times, so he is bleeding out now. He will drop. And he's bleeding on the floor. Look at that. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. Doesn't really, you d don't really see it that well. Because there's also flowers and sh or, or like leaves and shit, but. I pick if up you go my... into first person, it's easier to see. Oh, yeah, you can actually see it drop every now and again. Hold up. Oh, gore alert. Oh yeah, gore alert, I guess. Eh, <laughs> it died. And now I'm gonna equip my axe and I'm just gonna slash him. Hey buddy, how you doing? Ow. The axe murderer. There is no effect, that's stupid. There should be a blood effect when I smack him in the face. Oh, there is, but I was just too close. Yeah. Catch up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, there you're playing with the blood. And there are drizzles there on the floor. Plop, plop. There are more blood. Plop. And dead. <laughs> oh, here, this is now uh, spoiled. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, they are not harvestable for meat yet. I have to build that back in. I have the code, well, close to ready, but I have to uh, just re-add it. So I'll put it on the on the list as well. Chop exactly. <laughs> um. Oh, I need drink. So guys, if you, um, <clears throat> in the future, I also want to add in, um, farming, right? That is already on the list and I'm already, already working on that. Um, I guess my question is regarding to that. Um, if you, what do you think about getting food from, um, Get, uh, getting seeds from the animals. So, ah, uh, yeah, there we go. It works again, sort of. <laughs> so, if you eat an apple, you get a seed. If you eat a strawberry or a cabbage, you get a seed. If you eat a lot of those, you're gonna get a lot of seed. I could, I, there is, wait, let me just add another poll for that because I want to know your guys' opinion on that and it's kind of tricky. I'm kind of going to um, try and uh, add the trying. Oh, I can only do one poll because okay, never mind then. Let me just try and explain it shortly. So there is three things we can do, or maybe four. Uh, one, you just get a seed upon consumption. That means eating the raw thing because it's fruit or vegetable. Two. I can add a button in the inventory that basically says harvest and then when you harvest the apple or uh, vegetable you get a seed. Three, you get a seed on consumption but it is uh, with a sort of randomizer. So there is a chance you get a seed like I don't know one in three or one in four or whatever. We can I can change that around a little bit. But that's, an, that's also a possibility. So you don't always get a seed. Because then you get a shit ton of seeds. And that's weird. Um, but you maybe get like. I don't know. Um, I don't know. Uh, get like one in, in, in three. Or, or one in four. Like it's a certain amount of chance. That you get a seed. Random seed. You live by that. Okay. Yeah. 
Can I add a water faucet to my building? No, not yet. I actually... That's a good idea. I need to look into that. I either can make... I was actually... In one of the future updates, I want to add... Um, how do you call that? Uh, I want to add... Uh, kitchen cabinets and everything so you can actually furnish your house currently there is not a faucet option but there should be a well however i think i turned off the well for building so it's currently not something that the player knows as a recipe no it's not here farmables it's already almost in there um oh thank you i'm going to sleep through the night because it's really dark. Wait, what time is it? Ooh, mosquito. I don't need the map. 9.45. Yeah, let's do 8 hours or something. I don't know. Let's see where we get. Why am I hot and warmed? What the hell is going on? Oh, I'm thirsty. Damn. There we go. Fixed. I mean, you could do it like this that you have to, let's say, I mean, apples come from trees, right? Yeah. And to harvest the apples, you don't chop down the tree. You don't. You pick them out of the tree. Exactly. And yeah, the that's, same with that's berries the idea. and the same with yeah. everything. Yeah. yeah, it depends. So it depends on the do... on the on the vegetable or crop. Yes. Yeah, yeah. One thing you could do is you have your pottery thingy, your pottery table. Yeah. You could do it like this, or your kitchen table, or whatever. That if you want to have seeds, you need let's say three apples. And then you go and you uh, harvest seeds, as you, as you said yourself. And then it gives you, let's say, one, two, three seeds. And it gives you also, like, a fruit porridge. A time. fruit what? Porridge. Porridge? Porridge, yeah. I don't know what that word means. A mashup of uh, cooked fruit, like a compote. Yeah, like a compote. Yeah. Ah, okay. Check. Oh, that's possible. so it gives yeah. you that, but then you have to actively harvest it. So to get a tree nearby, you actively have to do that. Uh, and the same with, let's say, berries. You have to uh, do the same thing with ten berries. And then you get one to five seeds from that or whatever. Mm, yeah. Uh, yeah, garden yeah. store is definitely uh, is definitely going to be there because there are items and, and equipment. The thing is, um, this is, of course, sort of a survival-ish game, I guess, if you want to call it that. Or close to a survival game. The thing is... It's not actually a survival game as other survival games are. Because I've seen so many survival games where a character somehow knows how to craft everything. Or is researching it and then he suddenly knows how it works. Theodore Thompson is a forest ranger. He's not a smithy. So he cannot craft iron bars or... Uh, craft his own uh, he can sharpen his axe because that's what normal people can do too but he cannot craft his own uh, his own hoe or shovel or whatever so he needs a place where he can buy those items and um, there are places there will be a, a garden shop in the game and there will also be soil sold there and uh, the seeds will also be for sale there um, but I was thinking of a way to also get seeds without having to buy them. Um, I mean, it would be nice if you could maybe sell your crops or whatever somewhere. Um, to a vendor or whatever. I don't know. 
kind of have to think about what a good way would be to implement that. Because I don't really feel like... I don't know. Ah, oh, thanks, Lady Sagittar. Yeah, I agree. That's the whole reason I kind of... Oh, it's already here. Lol. Okay. That's the whole reason I went to create Yosemite Forest Ranger. And it's not... It. <laughs> it's actually a story... It's more about the story than anything else. The problem is that we don't have... Currently a way to deliver the story to the player in a good way. So the story is something that I shoved a little bit to the back burner and focused on game mechanics first. Um, ah, open closed door. There we go. And then in here there should also be one of those magazines that we need to. Oh my god, come on. I've made their circles small, so they are harder to pick up. But now um, they uh, <laughs> are all... They have the stupid dots above them. I hate that. That's new in the inventory crafting and shit system. Also zero. Why does it say zero? Why does it not add it to the inventory? I wonder... It's a pick-upable item. I am not full. No, not even close. Okay. Well, that's a very important piece that we need to fix. Also, we have a fireplace now. That has <laughs> crafting recipes and crafting queue UI. Because that's just a basic UI. But it only takes wood. And I think it only actually takes firewood. And not just planks or sticks. Does it take sticks? I don't think so, right? Oh, it does. Oh. Yeah. Nice fireplace. Big fire. Big. And it heats you the fuck up. Yeah, boy. Pew, 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 pew. Nice. Yeah. I'm gonna take my sticks out. Sticks, of course, burn way faster than the eventual firewood that will be in the game. And, uh, yeah. Okay, I think I uh, have about what I need for my testing for now. So, I have about 20 minutes left on this stream. And then I need to uh, go because I need to go to bed on time for my first workday tomorrow. Um, Ooh, yeah. <laughs> hey Amber, what's up? Welcome. Um, I think we will just quit playing now, and uh, cause this save game is broken anyway with the equipment. I still don't know why that is such a problem. Saving and loading the equipment is freaking terrible. Uh, I'm a bunny. Oh, nice. That's a long ass time. Do to do 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 And next week he's retiring. Yeah, I thought so. That's usually how it goes. Um, let's just save it over slot two, I guess. Beam, game has saved. Nice little thumbnail. Alt F four out of the game, and ah, let's. Uh, let's get some stuff done quickly because we have I have written down a lot of stuff but a lot of those are also really really fast and easy fixes let's see um and some things I need to of course uh, dive in more deeper uh, books not pick up that's harder it's good 
to read. So that's also something I'll do later. Yeah, let's uh, go to the item DT item table. I actually, you know what I can do? We can quickly try to debug what is going on with picking up the, uh, hello? Can I please do shit, please? Wow. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay, it's slow. That's okay. Speed it up. <laughs> and then lower this camera speed again. Congrats with your new tattoo, by the way, Amber. Oh, Looks yeah. Good. Exactly. Congrats. So now you had a work dinner tonight, are you not going to work tomorrow or? <laughs> yeah. Is that the reason why they have it on a Thursday so that they know people don't drink too much? <laughs> That's also a good possibility. Huh. <laughs> exactly, yeah. If it works now, I'm gonna cry because then I don't know what the problem is. No, it doesn't work. Phew. Okay, good. Let's <laughs> see. It is sometimes funny how people can be happy that things don't work, right? Yeah, right. I mean, it makes it a whole lot easier for troubleshooting, I guess. Um. Okay, you out of my way. Um. Oh, the office party is tomorrow. Uh, so the celebratory dinner was just something else. Okay. This pickup radius doesn't do anything. It's so weird. Dirty. Yes, she did. A big smiling cab. Bottle cab with teeth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, didn't somebody say that they would do it at like 10k or something? We're almost at three, so hey. I actually think it was Dan. I know. <laughs> but he... Damn it, we still need six. <laughs> we still need six to the 3k. Wow. Only six. All right. Um. So why is he not picking this up? What is going on? Does it have a level requirement maybe? Perhaps, possibly. My that sounds good. That wrong. Amber sounds really good, actually. I heart TT tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm off tomorrow, so I am allowed to do this. No recipe attributes, that's fine. Level attributes, it has none. Okay. Some people are out having fun. Been doing that all week. Hmm. Okay, well, let's just grab the code here and child pickups, recipes, carpenters digest zero one, and then gonna click. Recipe master. 
made a master code for that. So construction script, this one, and then this goes to the one and that one, and then we are here. Okay. What I want is the event interact. Pick up item. Why is this? Oh, it's not overridden. Okay, so I do a toggle breakpoint. Then I will go in um, over here somewhere. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Let's just go over here just to be sure. And tick up. Then we start play again, and we see what happens when I try to pick it up and follow the code. Forex, hi! Hello! Guten Tag, meine Freunde! And then in here I need to click the Carpenter Digest 01. That's the one I want to follow. There we go. And then now I should be able to when I pick this up, I already enlarged the circle, which did not really help that much because the character is blocking the camera's trace. Stupid fucked hard. God, why is the camera also... I feel like I am already maxed, zoomed in. Okay, now I got the breakpoint right here. And now we can follow the code. The ones. Yeah. Is it valid? Unknown class? Oh, it's not checked yet. Let's see. One more. What? Why? Oh, no. Just skipped everything. God damn it. And he picked it up. And it didn't do nothing. Okay. Interact basic. Motherfucker. Okay. Stop. Redo. don't have any errors that would show me what's going on Come on, stupid fucking camera, dude. Yeah. E, pick up. And then we have the interact. Want to trace it towards there. What the fuck? Damn it. That's weird. Okay, in that case, I'm just gonna add another one over here. Toggle breakpoint play so yeah this is the funnest part of game development not <laughs> why would they do a lawsuit I'm a nice guy okay Event interact, yeah, yeah, there we go. And now I want to dive into this one. Pick up the item, yes, and I want to dive into this one. And in this one, pick up item. What does it say here that it is? It is the Carpenter's Digest. Row name Carpenter's Digest, is that correct? Yes, okay, that's good. So the row name is Carpenter's Digest, the amount is one. Da, 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 da. Yeah, okay. And um get inventory item info. What? Does this already have info? No. Next. Okay.
godverdomme. Oké. Okay. Son of a bitch. Oké, okay. go, go back. Is this one? Yeah. I want to have another breakpoint over here. Item picking up, that should be valid. And then, when is that? All items added. This one sh is going to return zero. Why is that? Something over here, something is going weirdly. Level attribute, gain XP after pickup of these item. And this is just, yeah, the the amount of, le the, yeah, the level amount times the amount that he's picking up. So it's gonna, oh, you know what? Yeah. Huh. Yeah, that's it. Okay, that's interesting. So the level attribute, which category to add XP to? Because it will add XP on pickup, right? It is set to zero. Interesting. But still the level for none is probably being done. Ah, that's the problem. Okay, so I just need to add this branch in here after all. Why is that not in there? Fucking stupid. Um, let's see, how can we fix this? Uh, we need to use this and then... Gonna set the amount. Mm, yeah, I think something like that. Let's see if I go like this. Because if it's false, we basically just want to go straight in there. Um, you know, if it's false, the amount is always one. So we're going to basically change this promote to variable actually maybe be a local variable hold up because we don't need that everywhere promote a local variable and we're gonna call this pick up uh, mount there we go and if it's um, we're gonna set this default to one there we go and let's see if this is true then it's gonna set it and do this yeah that should work um no wait hold up this i did it backwards this one disconnects and then take this one in there no that's it okay we just need to put this one in there pick up amount and if it's true we set it to the amount of the level and if it's false we set it just to one one okay and then we go in there and And then I think, this is really tedious, but I think we are going to set it back to one over here as well, just to be sure that it's not gonna cause any weird shit. And then set this to one, just to be sure that it's not gonna cause any weird artifacts. So now it should work, I think. Let's 
toggle the breakpoint. Let's go hardcore. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. This might look and sound really weird. But this is the process. Interesting. Because the yeah, that's it. Because the level here it's set to none, and that's where it gets the number from. So the number, yeah, I guess that's what the problem is. All right, now let's go to the salt table real quick as well while we're here. And this one, this has um, let's see, craft it. Attributes, output for location, no recipe, no, it's planks. Planks, wooden planks, plank, here we go. And then output per location, and this is the workbench is three, six, player is one, workbench is six, and this workbench, wait, workbench, three, woodworking bench, six, Player one. And this word this should be salt table. Yeah, and then this should be workbench. There we go. Um no make this two in the workbench and make it in the player one. Make it in the player one. Okay, and a crafting locations, workbench, salt table, woodworking bench, and here we're gonna add player as well. Bam, there we go. Just need planks for that woodworking table, and it's kind of hard if you can't add it. Output items over here, it says saw hand. There we go. This needs to be emptied. Bam. Okay. There we go. I think that should do it. Save. If some of the dear rabies. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we play it again now. We should be able to pick up the magazine because it's not gonna be um held back anymore by the uh, oh shit, we have 67 unsaved items. Okay. Let's see if it works. And then afterwards I'm gonna wrap it up because I had I've said to myself that I was going to quit streaming at 11 and that's in about a few minutes. So yeah, now we got it. Yay. Haha. -ha. Oh no, we can't read it. Shit. Okay. 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 Oh, oof. That's good. Mm. Okay. <laughs> well, at least we can pick it up now. That's something. That's good. That's ah! good. Um. Yeah. Then we have read item. This function. Is that this one? Yeah. Paul, what a spaghetti, Emmy Gert. Learn recipe. Item is a recipe to learn. Okay, so it's read item because read looks better than uh, what you call it. Read looks better than learn if it's a magazine, right? Yeah. The default action is read. Interaction is transfer, split, and drop. It only shows. It only show drop. I think. Um. Oh, but that's of course because we didn't have another inventory. Okay, so now we need to go to UI widgets. Oh, hold up. Be right back. We don't have time to be right back. We need to end the stream soon.
all right guys it's time to wrap it up um i am going to leave this open for tomorrow or whatever it's always kind of difficult to figure out how this whole shit works um drop down inventory menu is this it no is it no yes yes it is place right behind there we go That's one. And I need this one to check if it's actually. I think I connected the code right. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so this this should actually already do it, I think. Let's test that quickly once more and then I'm gonna wrap it up. And if it doesn't work after that, probably want to try 12 million more things. But I need to I need to be responsible. And I hate being responsible. Well you have to be. I know, but I don't wanna. You know or I just want to keep on going all day long. All night long. All right, we picked it up. We ah, now we can read it. Did it work? Did it do anything? Yeah, exactly, lady. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Let's see, did I get anything new now? I had these already, so I don't know if I changed anything. Okay. Yeah, perfect. The problem is that I had to set the... Oh, come on, dude. The... Building system... Blueprints, no. Data model, data table and then the wooden items here all to is known no and then we can really test it but I think it will work actually also just click a few here so like this now nah, that's not that's gonna be harder this needs to be faster. It's too bad that I can't just shift click everything and just click not known. Ramp. I missed the spiral staircase. There we go. I think I got it now. Oh, I need the railing. This one. Yes. Save. Save all. Click this way. Okay. One more. And then I'm done. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Oh, good luck! Good luck at MI five tomorrow. Say hi to James and Miss Money Penny and Q. Yeah, will do, buddy. <laughs> oh, okay, here we go. Walk over yonder. Pick it up. Come on! Don't, don't, don't. Okay. This. Wait, wait, wait. Before I learn it, let me open the door. Open the fucking door. Okay, this, this, right, okay, now, we don't know any modular wood buildings, cool, now I go here, right click, read, right click, right, nah, damn it, something is still wrong, but we're getting closer, thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed this dev stream, and um, yeah, if you watch this later at a later moment please let me know in the comments or on discord what you think um uh, what you guys think about the changes that you've seen so far and if you like it let me know it helps a lot with the uh motivations and everything um yeah thank you so much for watching guys thank you so much for being here uh, I will see you all probably later on maybe tomorrow maybe during the weekend I have no idea but 
at some point. Thank you so much for watching. Um, and lady, I will send you some screenshots of the uh, gasoline system. All right. Thanks so much. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye. Well done.